it's your girl Fal. <laughs> now it's me Fallon. And today I'm coming with a get ready with me video. Um, I pray that this lightning, lighting, ugh, lightning. I pray that this lighting is on point. Um, you might see me look down a little bit because I have my a little monitor here so I can make sure everything is good. But this is going to be really um, one of those videos that's going to be like straightforward. Um, what, what do I mean when I say that? It's not going to be edit much. I really want it to be raw. I want it to be authentic. And just to be honest, guys, hold on, let me put this up a little bit. To be honest, guys, I miss watching get ready with me's like nobody's doing get ready with me's everybody's doing vlogs and this and that and you know it, um listen i'm not knocking knocking nobody's hustle but i just personally i miss get ready with me's um so many people always tell me that my face is beat to the gods honey and you know why it's because of get ready with me <laughs> so i just figured we um to spruce up this get ready with me um Let's have a discussion. Let's have a conversation. And our conversation is going to be about women's hygiene. Um, I'm learning. I'm sorry, guys, if it looked like I was looking up for a little bit. I haven't been recording in a while, so I got to remember to look at my screen here, the lens. So please forgive me if it looked like I was looking up um, for the first part of the video. But, um... You know, I'm 39 years old. I just turned 39. I know she look good. She look young. But, you know, with age comes wisdom, you know, with some people if they're living right, right? And I have learned that um, there's just some things that I didn't really learn until as I got older. And there were some things that I wasn't really exposed to as a youngin. And I feel like, you know, you got you guys know I'm a pastor, and um pray to slay ministries hey you could go to um our ministry page it's called fallon brown you could get all my teachings if you love my personality because i'm pretty much the same all the time but um i have learned that you know there's just certain things that you know some of us just don't know and the bible teaches us that you know the older women should be teaching the younger woman um you know there's a scripture that says that you know and i just feel like sometimes with the older woman they're hating they're hating on the young girls they're hating bad and listen i get it i see this this generation is different y'all getting money y'all fly y'all pretty and everything um you know with the internet things are different becoming millionaires you know quicker than ever but at the same token you know um honor the word of god and if the word of god says that you know us older women are supposed to take you under the wing then that's what it is and truth truth be told that's how it should be like you know when you're living life and you're going through things and you see somebody about to make that same um decision or something you should you know yield like want to tell them yield and let me show you how to do this ma you know what i'm saying so that's gonna be our discussion um listen i'm not really like the professional youtubers you know i, I my brushes came from amazon I'm going to try to remember when I, sh you know, pick up um, whatever makeup that I'm using to tell you so you can have an idea what my color is, what my shade is, and how I do it. Everybody technique, y'all can do it how y'all want to do it. This is how I do it, and honey, I be looking good, okay? Oh, I did want to show y'all this, though. My friend is a celebrity makeup artist, and she put me on to this. Let me tell you something. The skin at, um, active from Micellar, I believe it's called. You can get the blue one or this one. I always get this one. I know they have a blue top one too. You save so much money with this. I usually get the little, oh, do I have some here? Um, they didn't, they have ran out of the big ones, but I usually get, it looks like this, the cotton things, but they're bigger. I usually use that. And, um, this takes off your makeup. So people who always get the um, um, the wipes and stuff, I'm telling you, you're going to save money. You're going to save so much money because I was a Garnier girl, kept getting those. I think it was the Garnier wipes or whatever. And look, oh yeah, see, this is from Garnier. So this is from Garnier too. Hold on, I don't know. Hopefully you can see it. But this is from Garnier too. And I'm telling you guys, it works. So that's a Jew right there. All right, I'm, I'm coming through with the Jews. So the first thing that I usually do is girl i forgot what i usually do because i just be doing it and now that i'm trying to take but um let's just put on the foundation so i use nars guys this is what i use it's, it can get pricey but i love nars 
Um, and I use the color Cadez. Now, before sis could afford NARS, I was using um, L'Oreal. L'Oreal the Dewy, pfft, bomb. Honestly, I still might probably start mixing the two or whatever. Because sometimes, you know, with the weather, your color changes and stuff. But that L'Oreal the Dewy, the smooth Dewy, y'all, it works. It is bomb drugstore. But, you know, then when I started getting really good into makeup, getting a little coins, you know what I'm saying? Um, NARS works for me. I like NARS. So, I did clean my brushes a little something so I won't be looking too bad. Too ghetto. Um, I'm just trying to see which one I want. Alright, so I always do... If you see me looking down, it's because I have a little monitor screen on down here. So I can see what I'm doing. I just pray that the lightning, the lighting. Why the heck I keep saying lightning? Like, get it together, girl. That the light, lighting is good. So I just go right here. Now, I do have a scar, guys. I took off my birthmark. I don't know if you can see me. But I took off my birthmark. So um, I cover, I can, I cover it up a little bit, you know, with my makeup. I don't go too crazy. Um, That's what you get for being vain, foul, you know. After I had my two sons, my birthmark changed, y'all, to be honest. And that's why I got it taken off. Because a lot of people who know me from, like, back in the day, they be like, why you took your birthmark off? You were so pretty, the pretty girl with the birthmark. But it just was changing. It's, it started looking like a scab. And I just was like, I don't know. I felt like I was starting to get a little self-conscious about it. And my whole life, I never was self-conscious about my birthmark. Like, I really, really, I loved my birthmark because it made me different. So, yeah. So, yeah, um, so yeah, so I just use those pumps and I use the NARS and then I love brushes. Some people love to put their stuff on with sponges. I use sponges for certain things, but I really, 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 really love brushes. Now, I am going to be doing more get ready with me's and stuff, so I will get me a ring so the light... The light will be better, but right now we're going to have to make it do what it do. I told myself that I was going to do this. Today is a Thursday, the 30th, December 30th. I told myself I was going to do this. I was going to work my channel. So I believe in just starting and it'll get better with time. So just keep subscribe, hit that, hit that notification bell, that like comment, but, um, it will get better with time, but I just wanted to continue to just do what I said. You know, that's another nugget. Just do what you said. Don't wait for the perfect time. Like, if it looks off in the color here, it'll come together. Because I have took pictures and been on screen, you know, with this camera. This is a Canaan. But I'll get the light, the you know, the lights and the things that I need. In due time, it will get better. But I just want you to really um, see how to do it and everything. I pray. Right now, I look like it's cool. The color looks good. So everything's good. See now in my screen down here on my Mac, the color is amazing. So, so you just really blend. Okay. When you're doing your makeup, it is all about blending y'all. Like some girls I'll be looking and I'll be like, they be looking like they ready for the funeral home. Like we not doing that. <laughs> we not doing that. But, um, the first thing I want to talk about, about women's hygiene is, Give me your menstruation, okay? When you have your menstrual, your period, okay? I'm trying to, I'm just so lame in times. When you have your period, ladies, change your pad often. Y'all young ladies, I don't, first of all, I bleed heavy though. So, every time I pee, I change my pad. Like, and I'm learned, I'm noticed that girls don't be really doing that. Like, every time you pee, change your pad. Now, if it's just maybe a little drop on the pad, then I can understand you wait until like the next pee or something. But for the most part, change your pad every time you pee, ladies, okay? And drink water. A lot of y'all don't like water. Y'all need it. And listen, watch what you eat. Certain things that you eat, it throws off your pH balance. So certain things that you eat, it throws off your pH balance. So some of you will be thinking like y'all got P BV and you run into the GYN and this and that. And well, some of you don't run to the GYN. That's a whole nother topic. But for the most part, certain things that you eat will throw off your pH balance. Like um, for me, um, well, asparagus, everybody knows asparagus throws off your, um, your pH balance, right? Um, 
but like if I have certain seafood like if I have too much um, like crabs and um I like wild caught seafood I can smell a difference sometimes in my um, urine and what I would do is oh you want to make sure you blend it in ladies blend it in so this is blended in pretty good all right so this right here y'all let me see i always want to do that i'll be seeing the youtubers do it but i understand why they do that because you can see it better though when i tell you 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 can find this at walmart this is so bomb it is always sold out amazon this thing is like for, I think four to eight dollars girl Amazon had it for like twelve eighteen dollars cuz it'd be sold out They trying to get people Walmart when your pH balance is off Pop a probiotic and to be honest this is great for um digestive too because like my digestive system is all messed up from these foods Let me give this to show y'all again from these foods that they be giving us y'all so It works for that too take a screenshot don't say i never taught you nothing okay so then sometimes i take the thing i don't like wetting my brush i mean my sponge a lot of people wet they um sponge i really don't um i like mine's dry that's just what i prefer um so i usually go like this to blend it in a little bit more and then i take the brush and then i go like that more So yeah, sometimes it's like you don't have BV because sometimes when you smell funny, you know, girls be thinking they got the BV. Sometimes you got the BV, but sometimes it's just your pH balance is off, excuse me, from what you ate. And a lot of people don't know about probiotics. They, I Then I do my eyebrows next. I love doing my eyebrows next because eyebrows and lashes take forever. I'm going to attempt to put my lashes on in front of you guys too. Um, probably because I'm talking and jiving, it might be a little longer video. But I can typically do, if I really want to take my time, you know, I can do an hour. If I'm like short on time, I can beat my face in a good 15, 20 minutes. Like, um, real talk. You know, when it's just me, I ain't talking, I'm listening to music. But I'm, 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 I want to see how much with the talking and job and how long this video is going to be. But yeah, that probiotic, honey, it is a lifesaver. Let me tell you something. When you go to the bathroom, and I'm not trying to be funny. I'm really trying to help y'all. Like, you know, I have a personality. I'm not your average pastor. I need to do under, and I'm not going to do it because we, you know, it's for time's sake. I really um, do. It's time for me to clean up under my um, eyebrows. Um, but what I'm going to do is if you take the time and you do your eyebrows right and then you conceal them right, it really does help you when you need to get your eyebrows done. So I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show you. Matter of fact, let me get this right here because the light and all that. Like I told y'all, I'm going to get it together. This is, this is, I, as I'm doing this, I got to keep it real, y'all. This is new for me too because, honey, I never really be doing my stuff in front of people. So, I always do my eyebrows. The trick to your eyebrows, and as you can see the difference, you see my eyebrow coming in from this one and this one, and it looks natural. Light, light strokes, okay? When you do, when you heavy on the strokes, it's too dark, and you look, it is just not a good look. You know what I'm saying? So light strokes. I always go under first to, to make it shape how I want it, and just light strokes, and then I just I add a little length just to make it look. You know the way you want it to look but light strokes is your best friend light strokes yeah so um when you listen here when you get out the bathroom this shouldn't be an odor that's lingering and I gotta be honest the prettiest girls some of y'all, y'all, y'all cuckoo, y'all cuckoo, it's too much. It smells like when you come out, when somebody goes behind you in the bathroom, it's like, uh, and you shouldn't want to gag. Us women, we have a smell, right? We have a smell anyway, but it shouldn't, you shouldn't want to gag. I gotta be real with you. And the truth is, you need a probiotic. And some of you, you really need to go to the GYN, all right? I'm not going to sit here and cat. 
some of you you really need to go to the gyn and then some of you you just need a probiotic because what you eating is not agreeing with you and you young girls y'all don't have enough water in y'all you know you drinking which i say don't drink you know as a pastor but i'm gonna keep it real i know how it was i was young you drinking and um, you in the club, well, right now, you know, with all that's going outside, even though they still be trying to, especially in ACL, they still be trying to be in the club and all that, spreading all of this stuff going on. But, you know, you're not drinking enough water and stuff. You're not, a lot of y'all don't eat fruit. You're not eating your vegetables. These things, you really need it for the sake of your body. Like, you really need these things. And it shows. It it shows in your in your cuckoo mamas. And then some of y'all really do. Y'all need that probiotic. And I'm gonna show that probiotic again um before um before I end this. Okay, so now let me tell you something with the eyebrows. For me, it's never I I'm gonna fix it a little bit with the uh concealer. Cause this one, see, I knew I was going to do this cause I'm one, I'm freaking talking and trying to, what you call it, but I'm going to fix it. Well, I'm kind of glad it did happen so I could really show y'all. I'm going to fix it cause right now you see how it look. Now my eyebrows are usually, God, please Lord, don't, I prayed before I did this. Please make sure it look like how it always look. Um, my eyebrows is never really twins. They always sisters. So, but yeah, we're going to fix that. We're going to fix that with the concealer. Now, I love a concealer, okay? When I'm doing my eyebrows, I love a concealer. Um, yeah, some of you ladies, it's like, it's bad. And I use for my concealer, guys, I'm sorry, Pro Concealer, the LA Girl. You, everybody know about this. You could get this at the drugstore. I use the Fawn Color. Um... And a lot of your friends know that when you're coming out of that bathroom, that it smells bad. But can I be honest? They ain't your real friends. Because a real friend will be like, boo boo. You know, go to the GYN or something. Or even be like, ooh, you got your period something, you know, to give you an indication that something's going on. But, you know, some of these friends ain't real friends. But we thank God for me we thank god for me because i'm telling you it's right sis i'm telling you it's right it's like my poor like my kids child they is honest and they was telling me the other day we was talking about um you know workouts and stuff and losing weight because i have a fitness line but i ain't come here to plug that so i'm not gonna really go in about it but you know what what's going on in the world because i want to get monetized and stuff so i don't want i don't know if you can say it i know sometimes they say certain times you can't say the word or whatever. But, and then I use this type of brush here. I'm putting it here in this screen. The dog foul is right here. Um, to shape it. I'm telling you, concealer makes your eyebrows pop. But you just got to make sure that you light. You know, your hand is light because you don't want to overdo it. A lot of your friends are not friends, guys. And they're not really, um, I washed my brushes so they're a little stiff. Let me just tap it. They're not really telling you the real. And, um, people, and they're talking about you though. You know, they're talking about you. But, if you watch what you eat, watch your body, watch what triggers it. Like, sometimes you gotta watch what's triggering your body. If you, if you see that, you know, it's throwing it off too much and stuff, you know, don't mess with it so much. Like, for me, I love seafood. So, being that I love seafood, so I always come down a little bit, as you can see. Just, and then I start, like, um, you know, shaping it with it. But if you see the difference. Oh, she look cute. She look, she look, she look cute. Yeah, so they not telling you, but they telling everybody else. And it's just not a good look. It's embarrassing. And it's not healthy. You know what I'm saying? 
It's not healthy. We already, can we be honest? We can I be honest, we're already self conscious because we know we women and we know that it can we can get an older, you know what I'm saying? So you just wanna be careful and you should not have a strong odor. Like when you walking out the bathroom, people should not know you was there. That's just on period. Like it shouldn't be like, oh, oh, a girl was in here. No, no, it shouldn't be like that. And if it is a smell, it should just be like soft and subtle. It should not be a hard, like, woo, you know what I mean? And, it, you know, it's some girls that have smells that linger up the whole bathroom, the area of the bathroom. And that's, you know, you need to go to the doctor. I got to be honest, something ain't right. And then you probably need a probiotic. And um, you need to watch what you're eating because what you're eating ain't right, you know? For the sake of time and me not wanting to mess up what I got going, I'm just going to leave them like this. Because like I said, for me, they got to be sisters. They don't got to be twins. So then afterwards, I always take a brush and then I just um, make it look more natural by just brushing upwards. Okay, it's cool. Um... I like this one better than this one. Um, house. Like I said, for me, it's not always uh, twins. But they should be sisters. And then I'm coming in with my nude. This is from Huda Beauty. And I'm going to do, I'm going to do this dark color here. And I usually just come from the bottom and then I just like circular motions to get that look that I want. I come from the outer part and then I just do circular motions. Yeah, so you shouldn't be smelling up a bathroom, right? So probiotics, water, eating right. Watching what you eat, um, it it will help you. Um, I know I'm a pastor and everything, but I'm also honest. Okay, we're doing like we're doing an everyday light beat, so I'm not gonna go too crazy. This is just how I how I do um, every day. This is how I be doing. Um, I'm gonna be honest with you. When you change up sex partners. Um, when you change up sex partners, um, you know, sometimes there's a difference when you let, uh, dumb different people come inside you. Even when you change up sex partners, your, um, period changes, um, your period can change. So you just want to be mindful of that. The next thing I'm using is Tarte concealer. You want to be mindful of that. Okay. You, sh as a woman of God. Because I pray that my following will become, you know, people who love the Lord and want to become Christians or, you know. But, you know, wait. I'm 39 years old and I ain't dropping it like it's hot, okay? I'm waiting for my husband. I was married. My husband died. Um, but, uh, you know, wait until you get married. That's the, that's the, that's the right way. But if you are, just be careful. Use condoms and be careful. Don't be letting everybody come up inside you. Period. 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 I remember... Uh, concealer brush. I remember... I gotta hurry up, y'all, because I think my battery is talking about... And it has not been used, so I don't even understand... I gotta get, see what's... That is a good one, though. That's the Canon G7X. I pay good money for that. So hopefully I can get this done before it tries to clunk out. Let me hurry it up. Um, what was I saying? Cause I really forgot what I was about to say just now. When I was having sex, okay, because I'm not gonna sit here and act all holy and that like I never had sex since the first I got kids. But I'm talking about like you know when I was out there. I'll do a story time for y'all because before I gave my life to the Lord, I have stripped before. 
I used to be like, if you want to mess with me, you got to give me money. So that's prostitution. You know, I had, uh, I got a story to tell. Comment down below if you want a story time. Comment down below if you want to hear how I changed my life. But certain stories that I had. Because, honey, I got stories for days. Comment down below. We can do a nice little thing with the wine glasses. I will have some sparkling cider or something in mine. Or a virgin pina colada. You can have your wine. And we could just, you know, vibe out. But, um... When I was having sex, right, and I would let a guy, like, come inside me, certain cums I used to make me smell different. Like, I know it's weird, but it's just the truth. Especially, like, if they wasn't circumcised. I don't know. It was just weird. I remember I had this one dude, he wasn't circumcised, and I felt like... I felt like I smelled funny after I did it to him. So, like, anything could kind of just throw off your pH balance. You want to be careful. Um, this is NARS, guys. This is NARS um, custard. This is NARS custard. So, you want to just be mindful of that. You want to make sure that you are protecting yourself, that you are using condoms. Okay? But, listen, be like me. Be like Pastor Fowl. Don't do it. But, um, the probiotics, guys, it'll really help you. Because sometimes it's not BV. It's just your pH balance is off. And it'll get it back on. It'll get it back on. And, I, and, and listen. Wear panty liners. But you don't need panty liners all the time. Like, it needs to breathe down there. And sometimes that panty liner all the time and stuff like that creates a yeast infection. And that causes a problem too. You should have like an um sometimes we have like discharge, like my like you know, clear, not smelling, you know, cause our you know down there cleans itself. If you got like a dark discharge and it's smelly and all that, please go to the GYN. Cut this off and make an appointment now, please. Please. Then I use the brush and I go like that. Um, because something ain't right down there. You're not supposed to be, it shouldn't be a hard, strong smell. But some women have more discharge than the others. That's why some of you got that good stuff and then some of you know. <laughs> Child, I'm going to get myself in trouble messing with these get ready with me's. I, I already know it. Because sometimes I just be doing too much. But, um... I gotta be me, okay? But, um, yeah, honest. You know, if there's too much going on and stuff. I told you before, you just blend, 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 blend. Just blend in. Yeah, um. I pray that, you know, the conversation, I'm trying to make it, I'm trying to make it as entertaining as I can, but I'm serious. Like, I'm really serious about what I'm saying to you because, um, it's not, it's not a, let me fix this right here, put it more, boom, I feel like that's better. Um, I pray that the color is picking up. Hmm, 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 <laughs> um. You know, I pray that what I'm saying to you, you get in it, but that's a, it's a serious thing. Like, like for real, like, you know, you shouldn't be out here smelling. Um, we too old for that, you know, and you, you, you want you, some of you are in, you know, dudes faces and you funky, you funky. And so this right here, I love this. I believe it's black owned too. Black radiance. I use the color light to medium. It is so bomb, y'all. It is so bomb. Once I get more better, I can make sure I link. If I remember, I'll try to link what I do. So then I just come up. This is this what makes or break your look. A lot of people don't know um, that the couture look, that snatch look, has a lot to do with sculpting. So for me, um, I use the these two here. The contour and the scope. And then I just come up. I just come up. And like I said, if it look like I'm looking down, it's because I'm looking at my screen down here. And then I do my, you know, face like that. And I just come up to how I want it. 
You know, this really is, from what I hear, is the techniques from the nightlife of the, um, do, I think they call them drag queens. We stole their technique. But honey, I love it. I love this technique. But, um, so then I put it up here. And, you know, blend everything. And remember I told you, everything is about blend. Everything is about blend. But I really do. I miss seeing Get Ready With Me's. Like, everybody is want to do the vlogs and stuff. Look, I'm all for vlogs because I vlog too. You notice there's vlogging on this channel. But I be wanting how, you know, a good beat. Like... This, that's what kind of taught me. I mean, I started, you know, putting my own touches, but YouTube taught me all this stuff here that I do. YouTube. So you see already it's coming and she's looking snatched already. Yeah, already. <laughs> yeah, that part. <laughs> that part. Guys, I'm such a bird. Like, I'm a prayed up bird. That's how you know my age because I say bird and I'm from New York. I be like bird, chicken head. I don't know what they call them now. Comment down below what's the new name for birds and chicken heads. What's the name for them? And then I just go in. Now, I like to do it again. Now, when I go like this, it's like it lightens up the concealer. Cause I, for me, I love my thing. I love my, I love my cheeks to be snatched up, and then I love from my under eye to have like that light, bright look. Not too bright, but bright. I love that look. That is my look. And this is what I be doing. So what you see me doing is pretty much how I do it. I'm gonna take some pics afterwards so this gotta look cute honey and then when you do that it just lightens it up a little bit again because remember it's all about blending honey some of y'all be looking like oh they need to blend some more and it's already as you see it's already has that snatch look so then i do that and then i i usually work with like the same brushes um I don't use a lot of, like, um, you know, a million brushes. The, for my contour look, when I do my cheeks and stuff, I like to use brushes like this. Hold on. That has, like, a little angle to it. Um, now I'm taking Morphe. Um, a lot of this stuff you can get from Sephora. The Black Radiance, the True Complexion, I got that from their website. Um, the Fenty I'm about to use. Like, all the stuff I'm going to show you, um, most of the stuff I just got from, um, uh sephora so this is morphe and this is in the this is the face palette um that's rich ar that's what this is called that's rich ar the Mor morphe and then i just use these three these three bronzes here i use i like mine to look a little dark so i take it and then i just come under what i had did with the black radiance and then i come up a little bit like that I'm trying to make sure so y'all can see too um and then your forehead it is all about your forehead and your cheeks that's going to really make or break your look and ooh, it is coming together already coming together already yes foul i can't wait till i get my ring lights i'm gonna order ring lights tonight because Matter of fact, I'm going to wait to see what this video do. Now, I'm only playing. I'm going to order it tonight. Because what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do Mad Get Ready to With Me's and stuff. I'm bringing it back. She's bringing it back. And then I use the little, the lighter one to that. And just come up. I, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I go crazy on a bronzing. I'm a bronzing type of chick. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. As you can see, I got my Zuby in. Back in the day, when I was in Brooklyn, we called these Zubies. When you get your hair blown out, you know what I'm saying? And then wrapped up. I'm tired of wigs. Like, I, I don't get me wrong, my wigs be looking mm, on me. And But I'm tired. They mad expensive. I'll be paying three, four $400 for my wigs. and Because I like good quality and stuff. I'm just over it. And, you know, I be hot. Then you can see the lace and all that. I'm... Mm. I just feeling right now, 
Then I take the lighter one here. I take the light one. And then I just come. Just to lighten it up. I, right now, I am feeling. I'm feeling this, um. Come on now. Come on now. Don't even lie. Don't even lie. Like, yes, fell. Yes. I didn't even do this. I have not even touched the setting powder. None of that. This is just what I do. You know, this is what I do. I just pray to God I'm not looking up too much because I find myself keep looking up because it's there when I should be looking here at you. I am so sorry, but you still getting to get ready with me. You still getting that technique though. You still getting tips on how to keep the cuckoo clean though. You still winning, boo. You still winning. <laughs> so I know y'all, she a little off. <laughs> Sis a little off. Okay, so now, I love my translucent powder that I use is Laura uh, Mercier. This is the honey color. Um, she just bomb. She could be a little pricey, you know. They got a smaller one, I think, too. Um, but this is what I like using, personally. And then I use my powder puff for it. And um, I just put it under here. So you can bake it a little bit. And then for me, you know, it bakes it, it sets it, and it keeps that color. And then you go like that. Then I take some. And then I cut under. I'm so excited about this video because... God spoke to me and said, you know, I need to be more serious about my personal channel um, because I'm always putting up, you know, our gospel stuff. So um, when he said that to me, it just was like music to my ears. And then also, you know, I, like I said, I just miss Get Ready With Me's and I just love entertainment, you know, and I love entertaining people and I love informing people and just like to teach people how to do me, uh, my makeup because everybody always say my makeup look good. And then to have, you know, I try to put a little humor to it, but to have these conversations that our young sisters need to have, because like I said, some of y'all, y'all just too pretty to be coming out the bathroom smelling like it. And it's eternal because you start to look and you'll be like... So then I take this brush here, like, um, I believe it's like a, a eyeshadow brush. And then I take the little darker and then I come down. This is how you get that look, that contour look on your nose. And you just come down. I'm going to change my shirts towards the end. I'm going to comb my hair down, like... I'm really going <laughs> this get ready with me, baby. I'm not going to do a full because I just ate and she's full anyway. Now, nah, but I'm definitely going to change my shirt, comb my hair down. You know, we're going to really get cute for you. I'm going to get cute for y'all because getting cute is what I do. And um, I like to come now when you do this, right, and you come down and you um, you contour your nose for me as you can see let me come up a little bit you can see it like um the contour i like to come from like the eyebrows and then start to come down because it looks so much more uh natural when you do that it looks so much more natural and it looks so much snatch the snatch is all about how you come down and then you just blend it remember i told you everything is about blending everything is about blending and then I like to go like this to my, my nose. I just bring it up. And then you would take that brush that you use for the concealer. And you just pat it in. And this has still a little setting powder on it. Now. We want to remove our setting powder. So when I remove my setting powder, I usually use a brush that has nothing on it and I just sweep it. Sweep it. And as you can see, when you take it off, you see that it's defining. I'm going to have it come together and blend it in. And then I use another setting powder, which I'm about to show you anyway. But as you can see where I had did everything, it has that nice contour look.
And then I just go on a little lighter, just to hit the nose up one more time, a little lighter. And then come under your eyes and then you hit it again with the brush to just blend everything in. Sorry guys, I got to remember like to make sure that you can see too. All right, so then I use the Fenty Beauty. This is Cashew. I take cashew, I take cashew, and then uh, I take cashew, and um, I just blend it in, so it, because when you take the Lori Mercier, and um, you cut the, you cut the crease of the uh, cheekbone, it has that sharp look, and I don't like that sharp look, I like it all to come in, together so I just use Fenty for the bottom of my face and I just put a little up there just to blend it in but you see how it took that sharpness out sometimes it's like you can't stop and be like you know I'm the one saying no Pray to Slay Ministries will always come first. You hear me? Those that are watching me right now that's a part of Pray to Slay Ministries you guys come first. All right so I don't want this. I Lord knows this. I pray this don't be a long video, but I pray to, that these jewels that I'm dropping that y'all get it. But we gonna finish this up. So as you can see, she looking good already. Like hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, but sometimes I bring a little cups. Mm. Look at the blendo. It's the blendo. So we did that. We did our setting sprays and everything. Oh no, we didn't do the setting spray. That's next. But we did the setting powder. So now we gotta finish it up. Cause honey. I already know what the struggle gonna be. But I ain't gonna, you know what? I'm not going to decree, manifest nothing. Because this ain't going to be no struggle. And this video here is going to go viral. And because people been waiting for a good entertaining get ready with me. And I came and I saved the day. That's it. That's it. Right there. That's it. Boom. See how easy that is? That's how you manifest. All y'all manifesting in the moon, the star and all that. Listen, this is how you man. I have child. My own. So this is the blush. I use these two blushes here on the Morphe palette. I wonder what the name is, but I love it. I had, um, and then I just come up. I'm a blush head. So, sometimes I OD with the blush. You know, if you don't want to OD with the blush, that's on you. And sometimes I just put a little, just a little on my forehead. But, um, I, you know what? I'm not even going to get into the manifestation and all that. Because that's not what this video is about. And that's what's my problem now. I'll be going from one topic to the next. I will get ready with me was about hygiene and we just gonna keep it right there because we already um, was talking about mad different things I'm just gonna keep it right there right there okay now I'm trying to decide which lashes I want to put on which ones did I bring down here so I got these where's the other ones All right, so these, I was rocking these heavy last year. I got these from Amazon too. They so pretty. And then I got, um, then I got these I got from Amazon too. I've been rocking these like, I'm putting these on cause I did, it's my favorite. It's my favorite. <clears throat> so I use the duo. I know some girls out here, listen, y'all using y'all, um, the weave glue. 
I'm not knocking y'all, okay? My and I these is like my hundred time putting these lashes on because honey, I be wearing my lashes like forever. If you get the good ones, you can keep reusing them. Try to get just make sure when you when you order them from Amazon and stuff, like you also always get the this might be my last time wearing this though, because some got at the thing. I don't like that. Um, just make sure when you order in your lashes, always get like mink or natural look with, you know, it could be wispy long or whatever, but just always try to make sure it's like a mink lash. Cause at least you know with the mink that, um, it lasts. So for the new years, I'm probably gonna put on new lashes tomorrow. Now, <clears throat> lashes, sometimes it'd be a fight. But you can do it, ladies. I know a lot of people get the individuals. I'm a little nervous to get, like, the individuals because sometimes I don't like that look. And then some girls know how to really <clears throat> do it, you know, make it look so natural and stuff. But sometimes I like different looks with my, you know, with my makeup. So that's why I like the strips because you can, you can have different looks. I want a different look every time. So that's why I do these. I just really like them. So the trick is I use a mirror. And when you look down, the trick is to look down and then you just place it close to the lash line. When you put your glue on, you let it, you know, sit and get tacky. Because when it gets tacky, it um, adheres better. Um, also, also remember... Um, just make sure you put it as close as to your lashes as you can. Because sometimes people be having oil on top of their skin. And they be like, child, you look a hot mess. I can't stand looking a hot mess. And, you know, a lot of people use tweezers for me. I don't know. The tweezers don't work for me. I like to use my hand. So I just go like that. And then all the way, and then I put it at the um, the, the lid of it. The, um, the, the very lid of it. And then you just sit them. That's it. It's that easy. Because I wanted to do the full experience. Because sometimes I'll be watching them get ready with me. And they be like, I'm doing my eyebrows. I'm doing my lashes off camera. And I'll be back. And I'll be like, no, I want to see. Like, that's the part we be having problems with. And that's because everybody want to be perfect. And don't want to, you know, look like an amateur. Or, you know, or just look like they know what they're doing. But it's like, honey, we want to we wanna see. We don't want you doing the off thing. So that's what I do. I and then I just I leave it. I top it off with this. This you can get this from Sephora too. This is my set of spray that I use. This is the Fresh Vitamin Nectar Antioxidant Glow Water. It's a face mist. I love dewy look. You know, even though sometimes everybody think my looks be matte, but I use products that's dewy because I have dry skin. Now, for those that say, well, she didn't prep her skin before she did it, I just use Vaseline on my face. I'm, you know, a lot of people tell me I have good skin, this and third. I'm not, I'm going to try to learn to do a routine, but to be honest, I'm pushing 40. I'm 39 years old. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I do what works for me. So, me putting primer, primer has a consistency like lotion and stuff, and to me, it doesn't feel good on my skin, and it doesn't moisturize my skin because I have dry skin so i use a little bit of uh vaseline so before i did yeah i be ODing y'all with the spray yeah um so before i did the video i did have um vaseline and pretty much like prep my skin before i did it so i just want to say that for those that be like wait what this was a it was a raggedy get ready with me but it's fun but honey is i'm she's beat okay i know what i'm doing but um I just wanted to tell you, I did prep my skin before I put applied the makeup. I did want to tell you. 
please y'all though listen to the pointers that i gave you in the um beginning of this video because i know we have fun i know i talked a lot and stuff but i'm serious some of y'all y'all too pretty to be smelling like that and i'm just being honest and these are conversations that need to be had because the truth is a lot of people don't want to talk about these things especially pastors and i'm gonna tell you right now that's why some of y'all need to go ahead to go to fallon brown i'm gonna put the link in the description because um in the description box because let me tell you something I, I, i'm powerful you hear what i'm saying i'm powerful and i know my bible but I'm real and relatable and I think a lot of people need that and some of you guys are just you know and you're embarrassed and and I'm gonna show you the um the probiotics I said to use that helps with the pH balance um after a while it works so good you won't need it all the time and it's good for your digestive system too but it's also there for when it's also there for when um, you do need it. You'll have it. So what was this that I'm using to line my lips? NK liner. And I also use this for my eyebrows too. I use the NK liner for my eyebrows too. And this color is... I got this from Amazon. I do remember that. What color? Um, AA02 dark brown. That's this. AA02 dark brown. I love this color. This, guys, is my favorite 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 color and lipstick um this is from huda beauty this is huda beauty this is prom night this is from her matte collection i don't like matte but i love this because when you put it on your lips it does not feel like matte like i don't know wishy kind of guy okay i can't talk from melissa gun i don't know what formula she used but honey this matte is the bomb and this color is the one because y'all know new lips is in. New and red is in. That, you know, I don't, like a new type of look, period. You know how I did my shadow and everything. And if sometimes you want a dramatic look, I'll do it. Let, comment down below if you want me to do a dramatic look one day with like blues and stuff. But I'm a new type of chick. This is my go-to. This is what I look like. This what she look like. This what she look like. It feels so smooth. I can't believe it's nude. Like I really, I mean, I'm mad. I can't believe it's matte because it comes on so smooth. It looks matte, but it comes on so smooth is the final look <laughs> i know she's cute <laughs> um but like i said um i have just been wearing my natural hair out comment down below if you um the next get ready get ready with me <clears throat> excuse me want me to comb out my wrap on um you know on uh camera i just knew we were up here we were having fun you know once i edit i can really see how long it was um i pray that um this blessed you I, I know we had some laughs and everything but um you know like i said i miss watching get ready with me I, I just i miss it i love vlogs i love being nosy you know um i pray on me pray for me about that you know being nosy about people's lives but um for the most part i, I miss seeing get ready with me's having conversations um comment down below if you guys want to hear my uh some story times um about when i was out there in the world and i used to strip and you know when i was the other woman and you know all of these things um it can really help you i just want to make sure that i'm not just spilling tea on my um story times but i'm going to show you how i used to be and where i'm at now so it will definitely everything that i'm doing it's a method to my madness it will definitely bless you i pray that um this get ready with me blessed you um that you would take your uh high 
hygiene very seriously, you know, um, and it's just something to think about. Some of us, well, not some of us, because Lord knows she's smelling good down there, but sometimes you, you know, it happens. We're women. I'm not going to say oh, every day, like, come on, I'm a woman. But, you know, sometimes you have probably been accustomed to a certain smell and, you know, and you think that that's what you're supposed to smell like. And, and no, this video was your confirmation to get you back into the realization to know it's not supposed to smell like that. No, you shouldn't have, you know, dark discharge and thick and cottage cheese and smell. No, 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 no. So, um, I pray that this discussion blessed you. Um, I pray that, you know, my little techniques, like I said, everybody has their own techniques on how they do things. Um, but this is how I do it and how I get the look that I get. So many people compliment me all the time about my makeup. They be like, girl, you look good. Girl, your face be beat. And YouTube University taught me. So I just wanted to um, be a blessing and, and teach someone else what I learned. These are steps that I have learned. Um, the next get ready with me, I think I'm going to do more of like a sultry look when I do my red lip. But this is my everyday look. This is how foul. Yeah, this is how foul. I'll be looking. Okay. <laughs> Do you see the beat? Do you see the beat? Ooh, girl, I was looking up again. My bad. Because she looks so pretty. I just keep looking at her. But I know I'm supposed to be looking down here. But let me try to come up a little bit. Just so you can see um, the makeup, the lips, the lashes, and everything. And do you see how... You know, the lashes are to the line of the, um, is lining up with the lash line and how the eyebrows came in. I'm telling you, con concealing your eyebrows is everything, but this is the look. That's close up, how it looks close up. And, um, let's do was feeling me I know I was a little all over the place and it's not professional but it was entertaining I entertained you I know I made you giggle I made you laugh I made you smile subscribe like and um comment